Hi everyone, it's Miss B. I'm back again. I um, just thought I'd just share with you a little um, ice yarn haul today. So I thought I'd open this package with you. Um, let you see what I've got today. Okay. Now I've just opened the actual bag. It's... That's it. I haven't opened inside yet, so we're ready. It's a big old dirty package today. So here we go. Oh, here we go. Oh, it's all fluffiness. They're all fluffy. So it should be lambkin. I've never had any of this. Let's have a look. Oh, yeah. Okay. Get two in a packet. Oh, yeah. Never had this before, lambkin. Oh, it's really fluffy. Oh, yeah. Nice and soft. Um, so I've got this to make um, a mile a minute blanket for my son for Christmas. So, um, so I'll tell you a little bit about this. It's um, 200 grams and it's 100% microfiber. Never had this before. Um, so it's a really large size ball. It's really lovely. Get two in a packet. I'm not too sure how much they are, but just for my nice yarns. I've got two packets of that. I'll leave you, let you see the item number in case you're interested in this. It's obviously back to front, the number. All right, okay. And now we've got this. This is Fantasia. And the colourways black and grey shades. I've had the Fantasia in um, a red colour that if you remember on my first video I made a cowl um, well it was with the Fantasia yarn that I used on that one oh yeah it's nice it's lovely this it's got like a variegated I think like a tweedy look about it there you go really nice it's like a charcoal colour um, and these are 100 gram balls and um, 190 meters and they're 25 percent wool 75 percent premium acrylic really nice to use when i first opened my first packet a while ago with the red one that i had i thought i don't think i'd use it um because it had the wool and i thought well, it's not i don't know but um when you crochet it up it turns out really lovely and it's really soft really nice to use I've got another Fantasia in this colour and this is turquoise rose and brown there you go get four in these Let's see what this one's well, this one's a nice colour well, this is the turquoise I don't know about the rose and the brown colour it's more like a um it's a bit muddy <laughs> bit of a muddy colour and it's quite nice though it's not bad and this is the same fibre content again like 25% wool and 75% premium acrylic so this is nice so these are the the colours that I'm going to do is mile a minute blanket in if you can see I don't know if it's a bit bright in here today so they should be quite nice so that's my idea of that and then more oh this one's lovely oh this is alpaca glitz in a fuchsia colour that's that one this was a sale yarn I know this was um, about £3.20 um, from the sale um, and the 50 gram balls and you get eight in a packet, alpaca glitz, and this is 29% alpaca 
35% wool, 33% acrylic, 2% polyamide and 1% metallic lorex. Mm. And it's pretty soft actually, considering it's got the, the lorex in it. It's not bad, you know, anyone who has wool and alpaca know, you know, what this feels like. It's actually... Never smelt yarn before. <laughs> it actually smells pleasant. It's really nice actually. It's got a it's got a lovely smell. Um it's it says it's a five millimeter hook to use on this. I don't think I'd use a five, I might use a four and a half. Um depends what I'm making, maybe if I want something, you know. Um, but I'm a loose loose crocheter anyway, so but um, yeah, that's really lovely that. I don't think you can see, I don't know if you can see the sparkle in that, but it's actually really lovely. Oh, there you go, a little bit. That's nice. And then last, you see? Oh, this is the last thing that we've got. Looks like feathers. Feels like heavy, soft, like feathers. Um, what is this? This is eyelash in the white and this was on sale as well i don't remember how much they were you can see you get six in the packet of this one six of them well, this is this is super soft this it's like um it's like silky it is it's like it is definitely like feathers. It's, yeah, you can see it looks like feathers, bits flying around everywhere here. Um, it's quite thin. It's really nice. And this is eyelash, 50 grams, 200 meters. And it says it's 100% polyamide. <clears throat> Does say 5% something but nothing because <laughs> it's been repackaged because they've put an extra label on they've redone the label so it just says 100% polyamide um, but that's the thickness of the yarn if you can see that it's very thin there's obviously no hook instruction on it because it's been repackaged because it's on a sale um but i'd say you'd probably use a size two to two and a half with this um a bit thin for me if i'm honest because i don't use any yarn that's fine <clears throat> but i think if you doubled it up if you use two two balls at the same time you could get a nice good thickness out of it and you could use like a a three to three and a half on that so that's not bad, but it's really nice. I can't wait actually to try that. Um, I got this to make um, the fluff on the top of Christmas stockings. So I think that should be quite nice. So there's a bit of a difference in the thickness between that and the other. That's eyelash and that's lambkin. There's, there's 200 grams on that one. And that's the thickness difference. <laughs> if you can see. <laughs> that's whopping difference, isn't it? That is super king size yarn, that one. That's going to be really lovely. So soft, super. So, yeah, I think um, all in all, I think I did really well. Um, so I'm really pleased with that. Um, so um, hopefully next time I see you, I'll have started on this blanket um, and all should be should be well so that's it from now um, just a little pop in just to see just to see if you're all okay and um, just to share with you this little ice haul anyway hope you've all enjoyed it and thanks very much um, subscribe like share this video if you like them um, and I'll see you again next time. So thanks very much. Bye-bye.